in the coming days, a rather special baby will be born. His or her arrival will bring the world's population to a massive 7 billion. The birth could occur anywhere, but the UN says it's most likely to be in Somalia, where women have seven children on average, or perhaps in India, expected to overtake China as the most populated country within 20 years. Many experts worry if there'll be enough space for so many humans on the planet, but the biggest anxiety is simply about food and whether or not there'll be enough to go around. We're approaching a, a critical point in the history of, of humanity, that, that we've had a sort of 60-year period of slow improvement, of fewer people going hungry, of fewer children dying, uh, of sort of improvements in living standards, and that, that is now at risk. And the reason why it's at risk is a combination of failures in agriculture and farming and the problems of climate change. Already famine is affecting more than 10 million on the Horn of Africa and population rises are bound to be felt more in developing countries where resources continue to be scarce. But not only are there more of us, we're also living longer, which adds to both the drain on society and on the planet. For many the solution is simple, better birth control. The questioning religious customs and changing social habits will be no easy task. In just half a century the world's population has doubled and if current trends continue, there's likely to be 9 or 10 billion of us by 2050.